Good morning and welcome to Dulwich College Junior School. Uh, over the course of this video I hope you'll see the four wonderful things that uh, underpin a Dulwich College uh, education and particularly a Dulwich College Junior School. We will be looking at the fact that the boys are part of a small school but part of a world-class brilliant college. The boys will be and do everything. They will have access to all the different skills inside the classroom and outside the classroom and really do them properly so that they get a senior school education from seven years old. Also the boys will have access to all the enrichment and excellence right from the beginning of their time in the junior school and it's taking place within a kind nurturing environment where the boys understand their responsibilities, learn about each other and their emotions uh, so that they are kind citizens of the world. Let's go inside and see the boys boys in action. Okay, let's go upstairs uh, to the year three and four corridor. Uh, this is where the boys start their junior school journey. Uh, we've got all three year three classrooms and the year four classrooms as well. Small classes around about 15, 16 in a class in year three, growing to about 18 uh, in year four. Hi there, Year 3, this is 3G. Somebody would like to tell me what is the best thing about coming to Dulwich College Junior School? Yes, Charlie. Lots of playgrounds. Lots of playgrounds. Forrest. Um, the, um, the lessons because, um, are, because everyone's going to actually get to do DT or games. Uh, DT and games, new different lessons. Brilliant. Sam, what about you? The, um, all the sports. All the sports, lovely. Felix. The Really good. Lunches are really good. Yeah, Billy. The clubs. The clubs. Uh, Elliot. Uh, the teachers. The teachers. Oh, very good. And Noah. The friends. The friends. And Oliver. Um, the friends in the class. The friends in the class. Fantastic. So as I said, all the boys uh, uh, do everything within the junior school. So one of the things that they do is play lots of music. Uh, we do lots of singing uh, and also all the boys in year three learn a stringed instrument. All the boys in year four learn a wind or a brass instrument. Ends in two big concerts at the end of the summer term uh, where all the boys are part of a fantastic symphony um, for each. And many of them then go on to learn musical instruments uh, throughout the rest of the junior school and beyond. We're part of a world-class college with amazing facilities and one of those is a field centre in Wales and all of our boys in year four and year five uh, as a class go to the field centre uh, for a week during the summer term uh, to really enjoy the outdoor space, uh, to do lots of adventurous activities and to really bond as a whole group and then even when the boys pass into the lower school they come together uh, in the field centre uh, again to really bond as a new group when our junior school boys Boys are join the boys who come in through the 11 plus process. Here in the junior school hall we have what, are, what we call our kindness wall. Uh, we have three boards that really symbolise some of the key values we really want the boys to understand in the junior school. The key is kindness, uh, understanding how they can look after each other uh, and really empathise with uh, their peers. So uh, we have a kindness salver every summer term uh, for uh, all the three uh, four year groups. Uh, we have a contribution to school life uh, and most importantly we have our kindness tree where the boys nominate each other uh, for acts of kindness during the week. Our prefects award those boys uh, their kindness leave during the day uh, and they stand up and we celebrate them and we grow our tree so that the boys see that these are values that they want, they can see that they can be role models uh, and that the happiness that that provides, both giving them and receiving them, is very, very positive. When the boys join Dulwich College Junior School, they become part of a house and that becomes their house for the whole of their time through the college to year 13. Uh, within the junior school we have a huge range of different competitions but the key to their, their, their competitions is that we want the boys to participate. If they try hard then they will get points for their house in a huge range of different things from uh, aquathlon to uh, pancake races to public speaking to DT to art to maths. Uh, lots and lots of different things where the, all the boys participate uh, and they try hard. It, is wonderful to see them uh, look after each other, support them across the school, uh, and then when they come together with their year 12s and 13s, uh, particularly for the house music, a whole college house music competition, uh, it's an amazing feeling uh, to see the young boys uh, looking up to the uh, older boys and the older boys helping the younger boys. Part of our excellence and enrichment for all the boys is that we really value free learning, looking beyond uh, the curriculum. 
Uh, so one of the things we do is that we have a, a junior school symposium which takes a uh, cross-curricular topic uh, and asks teachers and uh, staff and external speakers to come and talk uh, about their passion about that topic. So uh, a couple of years ago we had conflict and resolution, we've had pattern and chaos, we've had time, we've had movement uh, where the boys have a memorable day with the girls from JAGS uh, and the boys and girls from Dulwichwood Primary to come together uh, and uh, learn about something that's really interesting interesting and really, really memorable. Here we are in the entrance to the theatre. Uh, we have two big productions each year in the junior school, year threes and year sixes, uh, with a proper production with a choreographer and a director and the costumes and the amazing uh, lighting and the space. It really is uh, done extremely well and the boys at the end can really get a sense of what it means to be in musical theatre and to be an actor. Dulwich College was founded by Edward Allen in 1619 and over our 400 year history uh, that focus on uh, access for, as Edward Allen defined it, uh, for poor scholars uh, has been really important to us to allow a huge diversity of uh, faiths, of ethnicities, of demographics, of personalities uh, is really, really important to us to allow all the boys to thrive within the junior school uh, and the college as a whole. The boys play lots of different types of sports all the way through the year. Uh, football in the first terms, then rugby, then cricket, but there's also athletics, there's tennis, there's lots and lots of swimming. Uh, but we also do things like a quathlon as a house competition. Uh, we've got taekwondo and karate, uh, as well as a, a range of other sporty and active, active clubs, yoga, uh, which are really, really important to us as well. Learning a sport and sports for life uh, is what we do at Dulwich College. Part of the junior school being part of the whole college is that while most of the lessons from year three to year six are part or are taught by specialist primary school teachers, throughout the whole of the games and uh, music and swimming and languages and science, uh, the teachers are actually specialists from the whole college. So we have uh, real continuity in that they can see them all the way through the junior school and through the senior school, uh, but also real understanding of excellence uh, and being able to stretch the boys as far as they possibly can go. Here we are in the Junior School Science Lab where the boys do their science, uh, all the way from year three in a world-class laboratory, exactly the same setup, just with the desks uh, and chairs just a little bit smaller as the, all of the senior boys just next door in the other labs. Uh, a fantastic opportunity uh, for the boys with amazing facilities and specialist teachers too. Here we are in the Art and DT rooms uh, that are specialist for the Junior School boys. Uh, specialist teachers, specialist space uh, and here we've got what we always do in DT this term in year three and year four, year five and year six. Uh, the boys love getting uh, specialist time uh, in these rooms. Here we are with our logo. This is uh, so important for the way that we talk to the boys and manage uh, them and them to manage themselves. Do the right thing, care for others, join in and strive for excellence. We use that in the way that we talk to the boys uh, all the time, uh, both in reports or uh, managing their behavior or rewarding excellent behavior. Uh, if they can do these things, they are gonna be very, very special uh, boys uh, leaving the college uh, and well beyond. Here is a good example of how we get the boys to do the right thing. Here is a board with lots of mirrors on it, which asks the boys to meet the person who is responsible for your choices, your actions, your effort grades, your success, and your words. We spend a lot of time trying to get the boys uh, settled and integrated when they're new boys and when they just start in the junior school. And one of the ways we do that is through our house competitions uh, and to the, the, all of the junior school boys when they arrive have a buddy. Uh, we have a team building day and we bring all the boys together in their houses and house lunch and house meetings and house activities uh, to really make them feel part of the junior school from a very, very early on in the first term. I hope you've really enjoyed the uh, look around the junior school uh, in this video. Uh, you've seen what an enthusiastic and lively place it is, uh, filled with opportunities, uh, how it's still a small nurturing school for the junior school boys, but yet part of the big college, and which opens up so many other world-class opportunities uh, inside and outside the classroom.